Welcome to Sit On My Bits, and today we're looking at a new cryptocurrency that is the world's first cryptocurrency for charitable giving. Hello everybody, Paul here. Welcome to Sit On My Bits. Now, I'm quite excited about this. Uh, as you know, there's a lot of ICOs coming out. You can get them for virtually everything, you know, whether it be a dating site, whether it be to do with cannabis, you name it, porn, anything. There's ICOs for absolutely everything these days. Um, but a lot of them are out there just to earn a quick buck. So when you get something that's good, that's putting something back into the back into the world, I think it, it's good. It gets me excited. Um, and this gift coin, uh, it's the world's first cryptocurrency for charitable giving and good causes. Um, I think this, I think this is good. It's got a good foundation to do well because it, it's it's helping people, and a lot of people, a lot of people like that. Now, in a nutshell, how it works, you get a you get a secure wallet that you set up with your own bank account. Then every time you spend money, a percentage it rounds it off to the nearest dollar, and it puts that into a gift coin into your wallet. Now you can set how much you want to do and everything like that. So it's not just taking it. No nasty surprises. You can set it. So if you go out, say, in the pub and you buy a round of beers and it comes to, say, $18.50, uh, then that extra, that little 50 extra, um, goes into goes into the your gift coin account. If you go out for a coffee and you buy a couple of coffees it comes to £3.80, then that extra 20 cent or 20 pence or whatever it is goes into the, the, the gift coin account into the wallet so that's basically how that works and you accumulate that up and then you can give it out to charities of your choice around the world so whatever you want it could be helping you know people out in Africa it could be helping animals anything you like so it's got I think it's a really good idea I think it's going to do really well now this is the website I'll leave the link below giftcoin.org if you want to check it out um, but just the fact that it's doing some good and what you know, like I saw something the other day where it said half the world is starving and the rest of the world are worrying about diets, you know, and that just sums it up. There's a lot of people out there. You go out and you buy a couple of coffees, you know, that little 20 pence extra that you're going to get in change is going to sit in your pocket, probably go into a jar, into a bottle, something like that. You know, we all do it and it just gets left there for years. But if you can give that back towards a charity, just as little as 20 pence here, 50 pence there, whatever, and it builds up and builds up until you've got a nice little lump, and then you can think, oh, I'll send that off to off to Africa somewhere, you know, and you can help a starving family, which would just be pence that's sitting in a jar going brown. So I think it's, this is a really good, really good, um, really good idea. As you say, this is the website here. Um, let's have a scroll down. Small change, big impact. Let's watch the video. Meet Joseph. He lives in San Francisco. He feels passionately about making a positive impact on the world. He wants to give money to causes he believes in, but is worried about the amount of money that is actually passed on to the good causes he decides to support. Joseph wants to be absolutely sure that the money he gives will reach the hands of the people who need it most. Thankfully for Joseph, he has discovered the Giftcoin community. As he goes about his everyday spending, an intuitive app rounds up his daily purchases to the nearest dollar and converts the difference to new digital currency, gift coin. At the end of each month, Joseph can give the money he has saved to the cause or causes he wants to support. Using the transparency of the blockchain, the smart contract inside gift coin tracks and reports where the money goes and the impact it has. This makes Joseph and the whole gift coin community feel more engaged and allows him to share with his friends and family the impact he's having on the causes he cares about. So whether it's building a well in Africa or fighting homelessness in Los Angeles, he can rest assured his donation is helping those who really need it. So yeah, I think this is a very, very good idea. A lot of people want to give to charity. You know, it makes you feel good. And if you don't, you know, with a lot of these charities, you don't know where the money's going. You know, you don't know by the time it's, you know, you, you stick a fiver in a jar. Someone standing outside a shop shaking, shaking a jar. You stick a fiver in there. By the time that, that gets to where it's going, some of these things on the telly where they show a load of starving kids in Africa or animal cruelty or something like that, and they want you to, to donate. You know, the majority of that, I think it has to be something like 10%. You, you only give 10% to the charity and you can call it a charity. 
Um, so all that that's getting filtered off, going to other people, you know, people people that are sitting behind the computer doing the work and everything else, or, or like funding armies and stuff, you know, there's talk of you give money to Africa or something, and half of it's going to the bleeding army. So something like this, where you know where it's going, you're in control of it, how much you want to give, where where you want it to go, and you can see where it's going and who you're helping. I think it's a really good idea. I think it's got legs. Um, I think this could be massive. You know, the fact that you can you can see see what you're doing. If you want to donate to put some pipes in somewhere in, in wherever, and you, you, you're getting the feedback of what's going on, I think it's it, really good. I think it's it, it could be massive. People like to donate. And, if, and a lot of people want to give. And, you know, you see the poor little kids on the telly and you want to give, but you don't know where that money's going and it puts you off. You think, oh, is it, you know, how do I know that they're definitely going to get it? But if you've got the proof with this, it's great. Everything on about this is the links below. So anything to do with this, if you want to check it out in your own time, watch the video again, read all about it, read the white paper. It's all in the link below. Um, but I'll just show you how it works. So accumulate gift coin each time you make a purchase our service rounds up the payment and converts it converts the extra to gift coin so like i said you know you go out you buy a dress pair of jeans whatever 1850 and then there's 50 cent left you know that that's it goes on to the coin send it as a gift as gift coin accumulates you choose who you want to donate it to and support on the gift coin platform so it's down to you. It's not filled just coming out your bank account. You set it to how you want to do it. Then track your donation. Once you have chosen your causes, gift coin shows you exactly when and where your money is spent. So it's great. It's showing you exactly how you're helping people. So I think people are going to love this. This is the roadmap here. If you want to say it's all on the link below if you want to check it out. So this token sale is on 9.30 um, March the 20th. Okay, so you've got a bit of time to, to get in on it. The pre-register is for the public sale, so get in on it. Check it out. Basically, the exchange rate there, one Ethereum uh, is 10,000 gift coins. So Ethereum's about, I think it's about $1,100 or something at the minute. So yeah, for, for $1,000, you get 10,000 um, gift coins. Obviously, you don't have to spend a full Ethereum. You can do as much as you want. So it's all here, and you can see here as well, if you want to add it up, it tells you what you're getting on how much. So 25%, 2,500 uh, gift coins. So you can play around with that to see how much you want to spend. So it's all done for you. Um, sale account, soft cap, 25 million. Um, so about 25 million tokens, uh, $2.5 million. Hard cap, 100 million tokens. So it, Except currency Ethereum and Bitcoin and sale price one Ethereum is ten thousand gift. So yeah, roughly roughly depending on what Ethereum is. Minimum purchase price zero point twenty five. Just saw up there on the the little uh, meter thing here. And the bonuses very important. So the pre-sale fifty percent massive discount for the pre-sale. Uh, and then twenty four hours. 25% and it goes down like normal um, the longer it goes on. So 47% to the tech development, 29% marketing and sales, 5% overhead, 7% admin, legal and accounting. All this information, take it in in your own time. Frequently asked questions. How does Maria in Uganda buy shillings from her gift coin to pay the local shilling only vendor or spades and buckets? So the local fund distribution problem is something uh, that successful charities and microfinance projects are already doing so in the first instance actually handing out the cash to people who will need it so they will get it's done by a local bank agent so they can go in and physically get the money that they need so all the uh, FAQs frequently asked questions are all here the team another good thing transparency with the team they're all here telling you what they've done so Alex here Charity founder and visionary in 2004 founded the Optimum Health Clinic. So they're not just people that are in for making a quick buck, they know their onions. They're all here, you can read about them, they're LinkedIn profiles. So they're all here. Even this guy that looks like he should be on Game of Thrones. And then you've got charity advisors, Lady Astor of Heather. 
author and charity activist. So these people that are, um, you know, they're OBEs. They're in on it. So it's it's good. It's going somewhere. Shirley Conran, OBE, previously the woman's editor of the Daily Mail. Shirley has been involved in charities for the last 30 years. So she knows her stuff. She, she's in on that. So everything about it is on here. So yeah, I, I think it's it, this. I think this will do really well. Now I'll just show you this on the white paper. So this is how how it works. Step one in a series of simple steps: the user downloads their secure wallet and links it to their bank account. And um, they then set a maximum amount per month of gift coin they would like to purchase to avoid any surprises. So like I said, you're in control of it. You set it to how you want. Step two, each time you the user makes a purchase, their gift coin wallet rounds up to the nearest dollar and converts the difference to gift coin, which is stored in the user's wallet. And then step three, as gift coin accumulates in the user's wallet, they have three options. They can, accum they can automate the wallet to donate their selected causes each month. They can manually donate to different causes as they wish. So you, you can control it. If you want to do a set thing, so each month your your charity or charities will get so much money, or you can do it as and when you want. I mean, not only are you helping charities, but you're also you're saving. You're not going to have holes in your jeans from all that all that loose change, are you? You know, you come in, you put it on the side, it sits there for months, it lays around. So you you're doing yourself a favour as well. I think it's a really really good idea. Gift coin. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'll put a link below if you want to check it out for yourself. It's all there, all the all the information. Um, rather than me read through the whole um, white pages and everything and make it a bit boring, check it out for yourself. The link is below. But I think this is a very very good idea, and I think that I think it will do really well. You know, like I said, you, you know, you see these adverts on TV, and you you want to donate. You feel sorry for the, you know, there's hundreds of starving kids. You want to donate, but then you've got the other side of you thinking, well, is it going to the right places? And then you've got to go through the thing of either ringing it up or doing this or doing that. This it's easy. It's all done. So you you know, and it's all the little bits of loose change you're only going to have laying around anyway, and you're putting them to a good cause for the people that need it. Or just accumulate it, leave it there. Then when there's a disaster happens or something, and there's there's been a massive flood somewhere, or a tsunami, or something like that, and they need they need resources, then you can do it there, and you've got a lump there, and you feel really good that you're helping from from sitting in your own living room without having to do anything. So I think this is a fantastic idea. Gift coin, I think it's going to do really well. Um, I say check it out. There's a link below. Don't forget, if there's anything you want me to review, um, leave a comment below the video. And uh, don't forget to subscribe. Click the subscribe button. If you like what I'm doing, click the subscribe button. And also, for all the latest news on new ICOs like this, um, and all the latest on the crypto markets, what's happening. Um, but yeah, I think I think this, is, this will do really well. Um, but yeah, I'll be back with you soon with more updates and reviews. And uh, yeah, be back with you soon. Thank you.